from a policy, uh, a macro perspective, um, I think that um, you know, technology is not operating in abstract. So obviously, technology is operating within the context of a changing society, with a changing business world. We actually published a recent report on uh, art and technology because we thought that hey. Um, technology is interesting, but you know it also can have a huge impact on our creative industry. For example, movies, design, um, you know, high traditional art museums, uh, and even gaming videos and stuff like that. So that's sort of the hybrid of art and technology. So I think um, it's uh, if technology can be paired with other skill set within the context in a changing world in various. Uh, uh, social and economic environment, it would offer uh, a powerful tool to solve certain kind of problem. It's problem solving. So, um, so I think that's uh, it's, it's powerful to 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 pair with other skill set as well. If you look at our education system, uh, one thing that it lacks, though, it's great in research uh, for certain area, but. It, 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 it didn't have enough sort of the industry collaboration element within our educational system. Mm -hmm. And the fact that, um, you know, everything is changing but our educational system seems to be changing quite slowly. Mm -hmm. But if you look at sort of the uh, continuing education, I think, you know, in terms of policy, a lot of us are still staying inside the mindset of, you know, vocational training, uh, sort of helping the unemployed to actually getting a job, instead of actually looking to the future, in the future, you know, how do they subsidize and how do they encourage continued education? Is it just a $20,000 for life? Is that enough? Or are we talking about, hey, no, we are not, we are thinking about education in a different way and therefore we should fund it a different way. So not all of our funding will be into the classical, traditional research uh, uh, tertiary education. But, you know, a lot of us should, you know, really think about how to fund and subsidize and incentivize people to think a longer term go for edu continued education designed for ourselves that is suitable for a digitized world.